On the first night of Sukkot, a little over two years ago, our precious son Yehuda was tragically nifter. Yehuda died at the age of 19 and a half, just as his life was beginning. Our lives were shattered, putting us into a situation we never in a million years could have imagined. These kinds of tragedies do happen, but as everybody thinks, until the tragedy befalls them, they happen only to others, not to families like ours. But this unimaginable tragedy was all too real, and it did happen to us, to a happy, normal, and from family. We now had to rebuild our shattered lives and face lives, our lives without Yehuda. My wife and I brought up our eight wonderful children, Kanai Nohara, in a wholesome, healthy environment. As we were busy raising our family, I never would have given a thought to watching a video like this on alcohol, or certainly sponsoring a video on alcohol use and alcohol abuse. Yehuda took his first drink casually at the age of 13, at a simcha, after which his world and ours were changed forever. Alcohol did not apply to our world in any way until Yehuda became trapped in it. The artificial feeling of well-being that it gave him and the ability to feel comfortable provided for him an avenue to solve his problems over the ensuing years. Then, as he descended into a dark world we never could have imagined, we began to realize what we were dealing with. Despite all our attempts to help Yehuda, we were unable to save his life. Yehuda wanted to live, he wanted to grow up, and he wanted to live a good life. He thought he would stop, and he thought he could stop when he was ready. He could, was convinced he could. But he was wrong. His life was over, and we as his family had to rebuild our shattered lives without him. We sat Shiva for our son and watched our children, both the married one and the younger ones, sit Shiva for their brother. The world of alcohol dependence is real and is deadly, and one who enters it, even casually, may enter much more deeply than one ever expects to. One can enter into a world that will never be escaped. We as a family implore you to understand just how dangerous even an innocent interaction with alcohol can be at a young age. If we can help young people understand this, and if we can save even one life, we would feel that exposing our tragedy would have some to well us. May this be Le'ilu Nishmas Yehuda Ari Ben Yeshua Yakir, our son, brother, and an uncle.